Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to crochet a two-face bag. You can make this in any color you want. If you would like to make a purchase instead, you can do so from my Instagram. Happy crocheting! Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. These are the two colors I'm using for the ghost face pattern. Dark green and black. The green is going to be the background color, while the black is going to be the face outline. This yarn is super thin, so I'm using 6 strands, with a 4 millimeters hook. Now make a slip knot. Make sure you don't pull it too tight. Then chain 32. Skip the first chain and go into the second chain, while doing double crochet. So you yarn over, go into the chain, pull the yarn through. Then yarn over, bring the yarn out through to loops. Yarn over again and bring the yarn out through the last two loops. So you're going to keep crocheting like this, till the end of the row. When you get to the end of the row, you chain one, and turn your work. Make 13 double crochets using the green yarn. After that you're going to add the second color. Make a slip knot and put it on your hook. Then yarn over and bring the yarn out of the loops. Now make 6 double crochets using the black. After that, you're going to switch back to green, and pull on the yarn to close the gap between the stitches. Then make 12 double crochets using green. Carry the black along for the stitches. Always pull on the yarn before switching colors. Now drop the black yarn, and continue double crocheting using green, till the end of the row. At the end of the row, chain 1 and turn your work. So this is what it should look like. Make 10 double crochets using green. Now switch to black and make 4 double crochets.
Make sure you have two loops before switching. Make two double crochets using green while carrying the black yarn along. Now switch to black and make four double crochets while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make 11 double crochets. Carry the black yarn along for only two stitches. Drop the black yarn and continue with green till the end of the row. At the end of the row, chain one and turn your work. This is what it should look like at this point. Make nine double crochets using green. Switch to black and make four double crochets while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make six double crochets while carrying the black yarn along. Switch to black and make four double crochets while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make 10 double crochets while carrying the black yarn along for only two stitches. Then double crochet using green till the end of the row. At the end of the row, chain one and turn your work. Make eight double crochets using green. Switch to black and make two double crochets while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make four double crochets while carrying the black yarn along. Switch to black and make two double crochets.
switch to green and make four double crochets while carrying the black yarn along. Switch to black and make two double crochets while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make 9 double crochets. Carry the black yarn along for only 2 stitches. Now drop the black yarn and continue with only green till the end of the row. At the end of the row, chain 1 and turn your work. Make 9 double crochets using green. Switch to black and make 2 double crochets while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make 2 double crochets while carrying the black yarn along. Switch to black and make 6 double crochets while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make 2 double crochets while carrying the black yarn along. Switch to black and make 2 double crochets while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make 8 double crochets. Carry the black yarn along for only 2 stitches. At the end of the row, chain 1 and turn your work. Make 6 double crochets using green. Switch to black and make 4 double crochets while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make 2 double crochets while carrying the black yarn along. Switch to black and make 6 double crochets while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make 2 double crochets while carrying the black yarn along. Switch to black and make 4 double crochets while carrying the green along. Switch to green and make 6 double crochets. Carry the black yarn along for only 2 stitches.
At the end of the row, chain one and turn your work. This is what it should look like at this point. Make five double crochets using green. Switch to black and make six double crochets while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make two double crochets while carrying the black yarn along. Switch to black and make six double crochets while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make two double crochets while carrying the black yarn along. Switch to black and make six double crochets while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make four double crochets while carrying the black yarn along for only one stitch. At the end of the row, chain one and turn your work. Make four double crochets using green. Switch to black and make four double crochets while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make four double crochets while carrying the black yarn along. Switch to black and make six double crochets while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make four double crochets while carrying the black yarn along. Switch to black and make four double crochets while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make five double crochets while carrying the black yarn along for only two stitches. At the end of the row, chain one and turn your work. Make three double crochets using green. Switch to black and make four double crochets while carrying the green yarn along.
switch to green and make 18 double crochets while carrying the black yarn along. Switch to black and make 4 double crochets while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make 2 double crochets while carrying the black yarn along for only 1 stitch. At the end of the row, chain 1 and turn your work. Make 2 double crochets using green. Switch to black and make 2 double crochets while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make 10 double crochets while carrying the black yarn along. Switch to black and make 2 double crochets while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make 10 double crochets while carrying the black yarn along. Switch to black and make 2 double crochets while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make 3 double crochets. Carry the black yarn along for only 1 stitch. At the end of the row, chain 1 and turn your work. Make 3 double crochets using green. Switch to black and make 2 double crochets while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make 2 double crochets while carrying the black yarn along. Switch to black and make 6 double crochets while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make 6 double crochets while carrying the black yarn along. Switch to black and make 6 double crochets while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make 2 double crochets while carrying the black yarn along.
switch to black and make two double crochets while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make two double crochets. Carry the black yarn along for only one stitch. At the end of the row, chain one and turn your work. Make two double crochets using green. Make two double crochets using black, while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make four double crochets, while carrying the black yarn along. Switch to black and make six double crochets, while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make two double crochets, while carrying the black yarn along. Switch to black and make six double crochets, while carrying the green yarn along. Make four double crochets using green, while carrying the black yarn along. Switch to black and make two double crochets, while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make three double crochets, while carrying the black yarn along for only one stitch. At the end of the row, chain one and turn your work. So this is what the front should look like at this point. And then this is what the back looks like. Make three double crochets using green. Make two double crochets using black, while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make six double crochets, while carrying the black yarn along.
switch to black and make four double crochets while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make two double crochets, while carrying the black yarn along. Switch to black and make four double crochets, while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make 6 double crochets, while carrying the black yarn along. Switch to black and make 2 double crochets, while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make two double crochets. Carry the black yarn along for only one stitch. At the end of the row, chain one and turn your work. Make two double crochets using green. Make two double crochets using black, while carrying the green yarn along. Make 8 double crochets using green, while carrying the black yarn along. Switch to black and make two double crochets, while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make two double crochets, while carrying the black yarn along. Switch to black and make two double crochets, while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make eight double crochets, while carrying the black yarn along. Switch to black and make two double crochets, while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make three double crochets. Carry the black yarn along for only one stitch.
At the end of the row, chain one and turn your work. This is what it should look like at this point. Make three double crochets using green. Make four double crochets using black. Switch to green and make 18 double crochets, while carrying the black yarn along. Switch to black and make 4 double crochets, while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make two double crochets. Carry the black yarn along for only one stitch. Chain one and turn your work. Make two double crochets using green. Make 8 double crochets using black, while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make 10 double crochets, while carrying the black yarn along. Switch to black and make 8 double crochets, while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make 3 double crochets. Carry the black yarn along for only one stitch. At the end of the row, chain one and turn your work. Make three double crochets using green. Switch to black and make 26 double crochets, while carrying the green yarn along. Switch to green and make 2 double crochets, carry the black yarn along for the stitches. At the end of the row chain 1 and turn your work. Make double crochets using black till the end of the row. This is what your finished ghost face pattern should look like. And this is what the back looks like.
Use a 3 mm hook to tuck the ends in. So you're going to go under the stitches and pull the yarn through. Repeat this process like to times. When you're done, you cut off the excess. The two colors I'll use here are dark green and mint green. I'll be using six strands of each. With a four millimeters hook, make a slip knot and chain 34. Skip the first chain and make 5 double crochets in the next 5 chains. At the fifth double crochet, make sure you have two loops on your hook. Now get your second color. Make a slip knot. Insert your hook in the knot and pull. Yarn over and pull the yarn through all the loops. You're going to make 5 double crochets using this color. Pull on the short mint green yarn and cut it. Pull on the dark green yarn to close the space between the stitches. Now switch back to your first color and make 5 double crochets. Always have two loops left at the fifth stitch, then switch to your second color. So for each color, you're going to make five double crochets, then at each fifth stitch, you switch colors. You're going to continue crocheting and switching like this till the end of the row. Always have two loops left at the fifth stitch. At the end of the row chain one, pull on the mint green yarn and turn your work. Now you're going to yarn over and go under the mint green yarn. Then you insert your hook into the first stitch and bring the yarn out. Then yarn over 
bring the yarn out of two loops. Yarn over again and bring out of two loops. So basically a double crochet. Now you're going to continue making double crochets in their respective colors till the end of the row. After each second row you switch colors, so you're going to take the other color while there are still two loops on your hook. Then you yarn over and pull through the two loops. Then chain one and turn your work. You're going to crochet in their alternate colors for two rows and then you switch colors again. Carry the yarn along and continue your double crochet. So you're going to continue alternating the colors after every two rows for a total of 18 rows. This is what the 18 rows should look like. At the end of the 18th row, chain one and cut the yarn. Pull the yarn through and tighten it. Now you're going to join the two parts together. Make sure you align them well. Make a slip knot with the dark green yarn. Insert your hook through the edge of both sides. Then pull the yarn through. Go under the next one and pull the yarn through. Yarn over and pull through the two loops. This is a single crochet. Continue making single crochets like this for the three edges, that is, the two sides and the bottom. This is what it should look like. When you're done with one edge chain two before starting the next edge. Then continue with single crochet. When you're done with the three edges, you're going to start making the strap. Get your yarn and make a single crochet. Make five single crochets at the side.
chain one and turn your work. Now make double crochets on the single crochets that you just did. At the end of each row, chain 1, continue to make double crochets for 50 rows. So this is what the finished strap looks like. I went ahead to make this part where you put the strap through. So this is similar to the other side. You're going to make 8 single crochets. Then turn your work, make 2 single crochets. Then chain 6 and make two single crochets again, then chain one. Make a slip knot and chain 14. Insert your hook into the first chain and make a slip knot. Make double crochets in each chain, starting from the next chain, till you get back to where you started from. When you're done with the double crochets, go into the first stitch and make a slip knot. Chain 1 and cut the yarn. Weave in the ends and make one more. So this is the second one. Now you're going to put the strap through here. So I also made them in other colors. You guys, these bags are super cute. You can make them in whatever colors you like. If you do make these and you want to post on IG, FB or any platform, please tag me I would love to see them. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel.